Goals come in all different forms. And in our house, some goal setting was, for some, maybe would perceive as a little bizarre. So I can't wait to hear what this is gonna be. <laughs> so one, one goal that presented itself every year was the goal to perfectly project the amount of candy necessary to feed every trick-or-treater that came to the house. That's right. But was, I think one year we came, you know, it, it, we were getting like hundreds, like 100, 200 people to the door. And one year almost we were going to run short. Oh my God, I can't let the, be run short for this poor kid. I got to get control of this process, right? So then I started recording the number of call of people, the number, I was doing a one by one, then I realized I'll just, I'll pre-count the candy, put the candy out and count how many candies left and that's the number, that worked out better. So I have records and then, then I started recording, what was the weather like? Ta-da, because the weather was an influence on how many people were, and what day of the week was it? So then I could get it a sense what was coming and then I make sure I had enough candy and I don't have too much candy, because then I'd eat it, <laughs> right? <laughs> that's dangerous too. That example, continuous improvement, continuous refinement of the approach to try and get closer and closer to the goal. Again, thinking back to that first office, you know, managing caseload, uh, managing a, a group of managers that are managing caseloads, how did continuous improvement manifest itself amongst that team? Like, uh, well, I was always changing the systems. I had a bunch of different systems to keep track of the employee applications. Eight and a half by 11 sheets, and I had the little, then I had the little view decks, things that went like this where you could flip them up, then I put them in a card box, then I went to the computer. So I was experimenting all the time, the new methods to, and I, because I wanted to get a breakthrough on uh, systems. It turns out the breakthrough is, is, for Bayada is not systems, it's relationships and responsiveness.